What does surrender look like? And you are pushing and pushing and you can't find joy or a way through a block and the answer is to surrender. Stop, stop, right? Rest, then when you're rested, you find some inspiration and then there is an easeful path back to your creativity. Push. I was describing to them what my surrender looked like and, and it was very dramatic. First of all, it took me, I don't know, a year or more to actually surrender when I was kind of getting the message to. The last straw was I had two bedroom apartment in um, Detroit, the second one I didn't need. And I was like, I'm gonna make it into a paper mache studio, right? Okay, maybe I'm not a painter. I can't figure out how to paint. <laughs> I'm going to become an artist of paper mache. Well, how did I come up with that? I was like, well, what else do I love? I like Jim Henson. I, maybe I'll start making puppets just off the cuff. Like you don't need to practice it. And not because I had this deep love and yearning that I'd always wanted to. I hadn't thought about it. I was making desperate attempts. <laughs> and so I set up the whole room with what? Wire hangers and starch and flour and water and newspapers or whatever. And I tried to start making something. I spent all day doing it. I tried to like make hot cocoa so I could like, was like calming myself down. Oh my God, it was a disaster, a disaster, a total hilarious scene. And then I was like, oh yeah, I'm not just gonna find an easy way. Like I'll sacrifice painting altogether if I can find an easy way out of this artist block. When I finally was like, I guess I have to stop. The story I had to tell myself to stop was maybe I'm not a painter at all anymore. I'll have to be okay with that. Not try to be known anymore, not try to succeed anymore. And that instead of just being like, I'm gonna take a break and be unattached, I had to like risk it all. So if you don't want it to be so difficult, it was so difficult for me, when you're tired, just detach, find something else to do, rest, make space for inspiration to come in and have faith that if it's meant to be in your life, your creativity will come back. And it is because we all have it in our own way. It needs to be fed and rested, right? Think of it as your horse, okay? You can't ride it if you're starving it to death, okay?